Hey guys, this is uh, Richard from Hashtag. I have got something very interesting to show you. This is from Bitsputter, and they were gracious enough to sponsor a video. So as you can see, this is the this is a soft tubing build water cooling from Bitspower. They also sent me out two five grams of their thermal paste, the TP1. I uh, was speaking to someone from Bits Power and they said right fill in the sponsor sheet and we went back and forth back and forth I was going to do a custom loop where I just uh, pick up the parts myself but obviously I've never done it before so I was like a little bit wary so I, instead I filled out the form asked them to see if they could send me this kit out which is for AMD so let's get into the unboxing Right, this is the first time I've seen it, so you're going to be experiencing this with me. Uh, it's a water cooling kit. I would say a massive thank you to Thermal uh, for, to Bits Power for sending this out. I really do appreciate it. Uh, the guy who I've been speaking to, very nice person, and he helped try to help me out as much as he could. And I said to him, I uh, first of all, I wanted a air cooler and stuff like that but obviously they said you know we can but they've got some things coming out so this is what's in the kit as you can see it's a soft tube soft tubing kit comes with the radiator which the pump and the reservoir has already got a connection to the uh, AIO itself comes with all the fittings and everything so let's give it a look is it go Roxy See if this will come off. If it will, have a look. There we go. This isn't very elegant unboxing, is it? No. Me. Hold on. There we go. I've got the other sleeving out. Done. Oh, God, it's a big. Whew. Okay, so let's have a look. Right, okay, so we'll open the it says Bits Power! Ooh, look at this! Wow! Oh, ho, 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 ho! Wow! This is so cool! First ever water cooling experience. I've never done it before, so it's going to be interesting to see what it's like because. <laughs> it's not going to be something I've ever done, so I thought I'd just take you guys with me And that's what's included here. It connects either to What I'm probably going to do is have this layout where the 240 is at the top and the, the Pump and reservoir at the bottom with the tube in so that's probably what I'm going to do So let's have a look. Is it? Ooh, wow, look at that. Oh, black sleeve in. Nice. Not sure my unboxing skills, I know. But this, oh, I tell you. I'm so happy that they decided to do I've always wanted to do water cooling. I've just never had the, I mean, I've just never really trusted it. So, I mean, just for them to send me out something just to do water cooling for my first time, I thought would, was very nice of them. Uh, it is a sponsored because it was a sponsor sheet that I filled out. So this video is going to be sponsored by them, and uh, ooh, wow, look at that, oh, wow, just come off, does it? Oof! Wow, okay, there we go. Something I will say, it is a very, sorry about that, very pretty. So it comes with all these little two bins, it comes with the fittings, uh, comes with these stoppers, uh, more fittings. Excuse me, yeah, I've never done more cooling, so this is kind of new to me. I'll have to even there. Oh, it comes with a fill port, is it? Oh no, sorry, that doesn't no, that's not a fill port, is it? No. Oh, actually, I don't know. I don't know. I'll have to read the instructions, but we'll have a look at them. So, there's the retention bracket below. There. This is the. Oh, there you go. 
this is the block itself now it's quite big but from what i've seen in the pictures this one fits my motherboard just perfectly so oh, wow it's a little bit small but oh well wow i like that that looks awesome that looks so nice it does i love the look of this right so these are the rgb fans it is a rgb as far as i'm aware Have a look. yeah a rgb these are their um, RGB fans. They are very nice. Yeah, this definitely a RGB. Very nice. Wow, I like that. That looks nice. That does. So we got that. This is the RGB hub for that. Comes with water coolant, the coolant itself for that. Oh look, it even comes with. Oh nice, nice. Comes with this pure pearlescent coolant, so it's just basic water colour. I'm not going to deal with any of the um, the the, the uh, stuff that Jay's Two Cents does because I don't particularly care about the colour of the water. It's mainly lighting that I'm going to be more worried about. So there's case screws. Very nice looking fans. Then there's the radiator, which is by here. Oh, look at this. Ooh, wow, oh wow, that looks quite nice, so I'm assuming the fittings go there, but obviously I'm not 100% sure, what else is in the box, I'm assuming it's two bin in the box, yes, ooh, it's more, ooh, right then, so it comes with the brackets for the pump and that, and the reservoir, this comes with a jumper, ah, oh, that's to fill the system for a jumper. Could just pin it, mind, with uh, little pins, you could just do that, it's quite easy. This is tubing. I don't know if this tubing's going to be enough, but it should be, I mean, it's a kit, so I'm assuming it should be fine. So. Okay. Okay. Well, that's only going to the CPU, so I mean that should be fine. If it's not, then I'll buy some more tubing for it. But obviously, if obviously the video still coming, whether it's not whether it is or not. So there's that. What is this? It says please make sure the contact of block are connect are correct and double check. Oh, I'm assuming this part right here is for like the they do different two different kits. They do one for AMD and one for Intel. Now this comes with a lot of wires. Oh, yeah. Screws, whatever that is. <laughs> Never done it before, so I wouldn't have a clue what any of this is. Uh, radiator. That I'm assuming is to stop it. Stop water flow. These, these, this little thing by here, you can just jump in with a pin. Now, as long as you do it with the correct wires, you're fine. It works no problem. This is a ARGB extension. The yeah, extender. I'm, I'm. From what I remember, the pump, the pump and reservoir lights up as well. I think. I'm not 100 percent sure. No, it's just the block and the fans. Right. Okay. So it doesn't matter. You know. Uh, so what I will do is once the unboxing is thing, I've got a couple of things that I've still got to do from Thermal Right. Um, as obviously I've already made promises to them. I wasn't, I didn't expect this to come so early. I was actually expecting it to come maybe a few weeks because I haven't heard of the guy who I'm speaking to, so I don't, I wouldn't, I didn't know. So from what I was. I could gather that it weren't going to happen, but I didn't know if it was or not, so these nice little brackets, the spear, you just put it in there like that and goes, and then you just pull it out, like that, and then, nice, nice, so, oh, this back. so it's going to be my first ever water cooling experience, and I'm looking forward to it, really looking forward to it. Now, 
The thing I don't know is if this is going to be enough coverage for the die because this is meant to be AMD and I know for a fact that the chiplets are in the middle of the die but I don't know if this is going to cover it all. But I do like the look of it. This is the AMD bracket. I'm assuming, yes, this is definitely the AMD bracket but I'm sure you could just use the AMD bracket that's already included in the motherboard but I don't know. I'm not 100% sure on that. So let's put all this away. But yeah, so I requested this and I requested some thermal paste off them because you never know with me with changing things so much what it will probably be do is I'll put it together but I can't put it together yet because I've still got um, air coolers from thermal right to do so I can't actually do this video right now but I will be doing it so that is a promise. That's a promise to Bits Power, I'll definitely be doing it. It's just I can't right now as I've got other obligations to thermal right to do video reviews and all of that. So, but I will be doing it. So this is just the unboxing, just so I can see. It's my first time actually seeing the kit itself. I had a look online at it on their website, which uh, I will put into the video by here down below. Uh, I believe this kit is about 150 quid, some of the guy is, but it's not bad because you get everything included. So, you know, I'm just going to do a bit of research before I do the video because I do not want to kill my system because no, my luck, I probably will. But yeah, so. So yeah, I hope you enjoyed that. This is going to be my first ever water cooling system. Uh, I'm going to do the reviews of the Thermal Right products first. Then I'm going to dive deep into this because I've got more stuff coming from Be Quiet. Uh, as well as a power supply purely for the, the uh, 500DX. So yeah. Look, I hope you enjoyed this. My first ever unboxing of something water cooling. So I'm quite excited to do it because it's going to be fun experience. Never done it. So yeah. Hope you enjoyed. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel. This is Richard from Welsh Tech. Goodbye.